Hi, in this video, I will be teaching you how to practice meditation on love. First, we have to understand what we mean by the word love. When we meditate on love, it doesn't mean we cling to people or want them to make us happy. When we meditate on love, it means we want other people to be happy, even people who may not love us back. So when you like people because they do things that make you happy, or when you really like some kind of food, this isn't what we mean by love. But when you want your parents, your friends, even the whole world to be happy, this is true love, and this is what we will be focusing on in this exercise. Love is an important meditation practice because when we wish for other people to be happy, it makes us happy as well. If we always want to hurt other people, or if we wish for them to suffer, we will be terribly unhappy ourselves. So the best way to be happy is to always wish for the whole world to be happy as well. Ready? Here's how we'll do it. First, sit down, either on the floor or in a chair, or even lie down if you like, and start by sending love to yourself. Why do we send love to ourselves first? Because of course we want ourselves to be happy, so wishing it for ourselves would be the easiest thing in the world. When you're ready, start by saying to yourself in your mind, May I be happy. You can just repeat that to yourself again and again until you really feel like you wish for yourself to be happy, not angry at yourself or distracted by other things. Let's try it now. Once you can send love to yourself, you can move on to sending love to other people. Start with someone you already love very much, maybe your mother or your father, or first one then the other, maybe a friend or relative that is close to you, who it is doesn't matter, as long as you already really want them to be happy. Say to yourself, may they be happy. You can use their name, for example, may my mother be happy, may John be happy, and so on. You can also change or add to the words that you use, like may they have peace and calm, may they be healthy and secure, however you like. The most important thing is that you believe it. You can practice repeating the words again and again until you really feel like you want that person to be happy. Try it now.
Next, you can move on to sending love to someone who you don't already love. Try to pick someone who you don't really have feelings for at all. Maybe someone in your neighborhood or at school, like a neighbor or a teacher. Don't pick someone who you don't like, but try not to pick someone who you already like either. Once you have that person in mind, make a wish in your mind for that person to be happy, just as you did with the person who you already love. This is a little more of a challenge because you have to develop love for someone who you've maybe, maybe never loved before. If you can do this, you are sure to become a special person in the world, someone who is able to love people without judging them. Try again and again, and if it gets too hard, go back to thinking about someone who you already love and wishing for them to be happy. Then, when you can do that again, try again with the person who you don't love until you are able to really wish for them to be happy too. Try now. Finally, try to think of someone who you are unhappy with, or someone who is unhappy with you. Maybe it's someone in your family, or one of your friends who made you sad. Or maybe it's someone who you've always been enemies with. This is the hardest part of the exercise, but try to send them love as well. May they be happy. Think that to yourself again and again until you can let go of the anger and upset you have towards them and are actually able to love them as well. Again, if it gets too hard, go back to thinking about someone who you already love or someone who you don't have any feelings about until you are able to feel love again and then come back and try with the person who you are unhappy with. Try it now. Great. This is an easy way to change how you look at people. Whenever you have problems with others, just sit down and start to feel love like this until you can love that person as well. Once you get good at sending love to one person at a time, you can try sending it to the whole world all at once. Ready? 
Let's try. Start with everyone in your home. Say to yourself, may all the people in this building be happy. Thinking about all those people at once. Next, send love to all the people in your town or city. May all the people in this town be happy. Then think of all the people in your entire country. May all people in this country be happy. Finally, think of all the people in the whole world all at once and say to yourself, may all the people in the world be happy. Great. If you've made it this far, you should be able to cultivate love for just about anyone. I hope you can see how loving others makes you a happier, more peaceful, and more content person than ever before. If you practice meditating on love often, you will see that it helps you make friends with everyone you meet and be free from anger and hatred towards anyone. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to practice it on your own or come back and watch this video if you need a reminder. May you be happy.